Hello, what's up mga parts? Kamusta kayong lahat? Ayan, maraming maraming salamat po sa inyong pagtutok sa aming previous episode. Nawa po ay nagkaroon kayo ng lesson at inspiration doon sa kwento na yun. And, okay, keep the like, comment, and share coming po at Taraki TV. Yan mga parts, at ngayon nga araw na naman, mayroon na naman tayong ipaan itong matutunghayan ngayon. Kaya dyan lang po kayo, ito po ang inyong parts, Tigo. At ako naman ang inyong parts, Ken, para sa Taraki Talks. And bago ang lahat, uh-huh. pasalamatan naman natin ang ating mga sponsors sa episode na ito. M. Avila, yes, M. Avila Law Office, St. Joseph Driving School, Ayan, Richard Kilaan Law Office, the Richie Salon, at of course, ang Kabato Medical Clinic, and North Crew, ah, no, sorry. Kabato Medical Clinic North Cross Laboratories. Ay, yeah. yan naman. Oh, diba? ang, ang itsura ng aming location ngayong araw na ito, para kaming nasa isang studio na nagre-report. Diba? <laughs> exactly. Ay, yan, diba? Kaya medyo, mm. na ano yung dila ko doon. <laughs> anyway, mga parts namin at mga katarahi, nais ko talaga na ipakilala ngayon ng ating magiging uh, panauhing Panauhin. Pandangan. <laughs> Panauhin pandangan. Ayan ko. Pero kuhan, mga parts, uh, taga Highland but lang ni Manong tayo. Mm. Siyempre, it's the same story with most of the Highlanders nga. We, we experienced uh, poor life before. Iso nga ni Manong tayo but he was able to sell din different kinds of products like oh. toron, kakasida, pancakes. Hindi ka uwing na. Tapos naging construction worker but lang house helper and a laborer is a Benguet Corporation. Ayan. So, si Manong natin, she is actually married to Miss Nancy G. Joseph of Nagay at of Benguet. Ayan. Tapos nagtak- nagtapos siya ng uh, tech voc. Mm-hmm. Alright? Technical vocation yun, sir? Uh, oo. Mm-hmm. Technical. From, the, from the lowest. Oo. Oh, oh. Hanggang papakyat. Tech voc na electrical technology. Oh. Ayan. Meron pa yung isa eh. And then, nung college naman, kumuha siya ng Bachelor of Laws and then BSE. Now na yung BSE, mga parts natin. BSE, major in history and uh, yes. yung physical, physical education. education. I'm sure you're a minor pala. Okay, uh, mama. <laughs> <laughs> Ayan na nga. And then, meron din siyang um, <laughs> MA, uh, Master's of Arts in Educational Management as well as Doctor in Philosophy. So, nag-retire siya as a maestro noong 2017. Tawang sir? Oo. Yes, 2017. Kaya, mga parts and katarakin natin, we, let us all welcome our maestro. Maestro Mario de los Reyes. Hello, ano? Good morning. Oh, good morning po. Mm-hmm. Good morning, Bendel. At good morning, Ken. Mm-hmm. Thank you for having me in your uh, program. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Maraming salamat din po. Oh, may baka may babatiin po kayo, parts. I, uh, I would want to greet my family first, first and foremost uh, my wife my children and of course uh, my constituents here in uh, barangay pakdal as well as the uh, constituent constituency of bagyo Ay, uh, oh nga pala barangay kagawad si manong mario and Bar- president, president of senior citizens. citizen organization Zins. <laughs> sorry naman <laughs> Ayun. Okay. At saka yung dalawang anak niya, actually PMA years? Oo, oh, PMA. Wow. Both are PMA graduates mm-hmm. and they are both uh, with the Philippine Air Force. Ah, uh, iba. Uh, <laughs> Love her. Uh-huh. <laughs> anyway, parents, no? Um, na- narinig ko kanina, sinabi mo na anong tawag na nito? <laughs> Nagtinda siya ng pancakes. Oo, oh, yung bata siya. He was once also a construction worker. Mm. Nangyari ito saan po? Sa... Uh, so, I was uh, born, or I hail from Kilometer 102 Mount Data Baoko Mountain Province. One mountain. Oh, I grew <laughs> up there. Oh. I grew up there. Mm. So I have uh, uh, been there for, from birth since the time, until the time I came to Baguio for my studies. Oh. Grabe. Kaya doon nagsimula lahat. Oh. Um, kasap mo kayo ngayon nga nag, nag-ruging uh, nga naglaklako dito ron, kakasdaila. Uh, uh, I come from a poor family mm-hmm. of 12 siblings. Uy. Uh, I, am, wow. I am the fifth. Mm-hmm. So, uh, during that time, life was really very difficult. Mm-hmm. Uh, so, my father is just an ordinary laborer. So, 
in fact uh, during my elementary years mm -hmm. i already started working like uh, selling hot cake in turon mm -hmm. to passenger bus passing by that place and si also o dangwa bus oh, dangwa ah, bus pa yung old pa nga eh yung diretso yung upuan oh, oh. Uh, <laughs> nakita mo na rin po oh naman and then uh, i also work in the vegetable gardens mm -hmm. carrying or hauling vegetables from a distant mm -hmm. mountain or and uh, going back the materials mm -hmm. uh, then uh, in high school during the time high school was not yet free so i studied in san isidro High school, Abatan, Mangkayan, Binget. Uh, oh. The same, I have to work uh, during weekends mm -hmm. uh, in the vegetable gardens mm -hmm. or selling hot cake in Toron or any other kind of job that they will offer, offer. me just for me to be able to uh, earn some mm -hmm. money for my allowance, yes. so, uh, 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 for my tuition fee. Okay. Tuition fee during the time was very cheap but you know, money was difficult. 90 pesos sa San Isidro High School during my high school days. But uh, it's really very difficult to earn. Oh. So thinking about it, no? Kasi mm. comparing it family, it is mm. that time. Yeah? Mm. I got, before you get a uh, paramihan ba? <laughs> no. Oh, uh, uh, kasi mostly 20 kasi yeah, yeah, number or, of children yes. apart. So, yeah. Or 8, 7, yes. actually large talagang oh. families before. But I just wonder, you know, what is realization you from those experiences having a big number of family oh, oh. members and now mm -hmm. comparing to oh, now? Yes, uh, the big families are really a very enjoyable experience. Mm -hmm. Then my parents would consider having more, uh, more, more children <laughs> as, as, as their wealth. Oh. Ah, yeah. If you, oh, oh, it's okay. I, this time it's ironic. I only have two children. <laughs> oh. You want more, ba? Uh, <laughs> I, I, oh, <laughs> oh, oh, I really did want more, but mm. siguro yun lang ang binigay ng Jose. Eh. Ah, oh. yeah. I actually, and, it's 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 wealth. The oh. number of children is wealth. Oh, for them. Oh, yeah. For them. Ngayon naman para sa inyo yung mga anak ninyo. Ah, uh, my children, they only, my first child, they have one. Mm -hmm. And then this, my second have another also one. Because Although they intend to have more. more. Oh. Oh. Uh, because they're still siguro oh. around the late twenties, kanya. No? Uh, early thirties na sila. Oh. Ah, early thirties. Okay, pwede pa? Love and girl. I mean, huh? sa preparang yung perception ng parents in yah it mm. care it, tending children before and now. Yes. So, anyways, maraming maraming salamat dahil hindi man uh, hindi man marami no, oh. pero maraming naman kay mga anak dahil sa mga sujanti rin. Oh, oh. Exactly. Uh, Grabe. Yun na nga, mga hmm. parts kaya nagturo din siya pala sa hmm. SLU. Oh. Yes. Mm -hmm. Boys high. Oh, boys high. Mm -hmm. Actually, I have been with the. Uh, St. Louis University for 37 years, including my being a working student. Wow, 37 years. Uh, oh. wow. Four Service. years, uh, four years as a working student. Mm -hmm. uh, then no, yeah. <laughs> uh, I have been employed, employed by SLU. First, parang yung training ground ko, kasi connected lahat yan. Mm. Uh, Pag-aari ng mga Belgian priests. Mm -hmm. I first taught in St. Louis High School, Antamok. Then, uh, pre parang pre-remote nila ako sa boys high. Mm -hmm. oh, ah, parang okay, so parang practice ko pa lang yun. Uh -huh. oh, then, so, uh, boys high uh, from 1985 uh, up to the time I retired. Mm -hmm. uh, teaching, uh, when I earned my master's, they already allowed me to teach in uh, okay. college. Oh. Because the laboratory school actually is a part of the yeah, of no, the college of education. Ay, pero parts kung ngay, ay sir manong DJ DJ inala yung ng undergraduate yung PSE major yung is history. Oh, history. How about the physical education? The physical education was at first minor, but then during that time there was the time na the male teachers in boys high were fewer than the female teachers. teachers so the principal said you take uh, 
uh, to to be able to teach the boys, uh, boys physical time. education, yes. or they sent me to UP Diliman ah. for, uh, the uh, for the minor, and at the same time, uh, special studies ah. on sports management. Oh. Pwede pa lang ganun noon? Oh. Oh. Pa- parang wala kayong minor? Wala ba? Hindi, nung time na namin nakat na yung mga May minor, minor na. na. So major na lang siya. Oh. Talagang you specialize on that. Oh. Yes. Ganun pala. Oh. So naging physical education teacher din pala kayo. Oh. So, oh. But anyway, mm. sino kumuyog sa inyong mag-edo? Oo <laughs> uh, nga. When I studied in college, I was it was some sort of uh, late already, 23 years old na ako. Ah. And really, uh, uh, I, sa- I somehow helped my parents in raising the family. Mm-hmm. Nung nagtrabaho na ako sa uh, Held Lumber at saka sa Benguet Corporation, parang nagbibigay din ako na imagine uh, for all. Uh, nice. mm-hmm. So, when I was given an opportunity, I came to know of uh, uh, SLU uh, opening mm. uh, some sort of scholarship for uh-huh. those who would want to study in college. So, nag-apply ako na working student. Mm. I have been with SLU Boys Dorm uh, practically doing all the mm-hmm. dirty jobs. Uh, tagalinis ng CR. Oh. So, yung bowl, magmap ng floor. And uh, at the same time, uh, studying. Oh. And that must be a difficult task. Yeah. Yeah. Studying, really? Working while studying, but yeah. you have oh. to. At the same time, no, parang nagkaroon ka din ng age intimidation during that time kasi oh, yeah. late. Pero, you know, it doesn't matter. Not, yeah. no, it's, it's not a reason oh. for you not to continue your studies. Mm. No. In fact, at first, parang nahihiya ako sa mga kaklasi dahil mm. yung mga introduction, ah. I, yung nag nag introduce sila mm. yung mga nagsasabing graduate sila ng San Isidro High School eh, hindi ko nakilala so, pag sinabi kong San Isidro High School, High School ako ka, oh, graduate, graduate kailan ka kailan ang year na graduate ka ganun na so uh, nung tu- nung panahon na yun talagang really it's uh, very difficult mm. but i was able to manage mm. uh, not bragging pero uh, kahit na working student ako, academic scholar. Yes. Uh, graduated uh, with flying uh, colors. Yes. Then, uh, yung refund, mm. yun ang ginagamit kong allowance ko for the semester. I'm a refund. Oh, oh. Oh, kasi kung uh, 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 working student ka, di free lahat. Oh. Pero mag academic scholar ka na naman, May yung na earn mo, i i i i Talagang push na push so, niya na mag-academic. That is motivation mm-hmm. yung para mm-hmm. sa mga students. And one more thing, Manu. You've also taken your Bachelor of Laws. Mm-hmm. Uh, uh, yeah. Uh, mm-hmm. Sa SLU din, sir. Yes. Mm-hmm. While studying, uh, while working, mm-hmm. uh, I was motivated really. You know, in the, in, in SLU, the, ang yung parang kalakaran doon, pag hindi ka nag-upgrade o nag-kwa uh, nag, uh, sa career development mo, hindi ka mapopromote. Oo oh, naman. Oh. So, well, I guess it goes with other institutions as well. Then, uh, sabi nila nung ginawa akong prefix of discipline, you have to some, have some knowledge on law. Mm. Oh, because you will be dealing with uh, violation of students, the ah. rights. Oh. So, uh, oh, <laughs> so, kumuha ako ng uh, law. Mm-hmm. Mm. Para man ang maintindihan mm. din yung conditions oh. or yung state. Yes. Oh. Uh, yeah. Kamusta mm. naman kasi parang 37 years of teaching. Yes. Punta natin yung first. Mm. First, first years, years of, of teaching, teaching. like okay. um uh, sige punta muna natin yung high school. Kamusta mm. yung uh, teaching curriculums natin nung time na yun? Oh. Compared kung may, may kung pwede lang ah, <laughs> kung may compare mo sa curriculums, teaching curriculums ngayon. Uh, during those times uh, uh for uh, it's like a college uh, schedule, mm. three times a week uh, per hour. Three One times hour. a week? Oh, for example, uh, uh, history, uh-oh. MWF. Parang ah, ah, or, ah? Oh, oh, scheduled pa na parang ganun. But later on in the 1990s, na, na, na iba, uh, Secondary Education Development Program. Yun ang 40 minutes per 
period na. Oh, Pe- pero sabi, daily. Ko yan. Ay, that is oh. in the high school. Yes. <laughs> ah, pero naging oh, 40 minutes daily na. Oo, oh, oh, oh. daily na siya. Na oh. naging 1 hour daily. <laughs> oh, kasi oh. yung naging trainer ako ng secondary education development program. Okay. Mm-hmm. Trainin yes. kami. So ako trainin ko rin yung mga teachers. Yes. Oh. So to uh do, oh, to the para para ma-upgrade sila sa uh, secondary education development program. Ayun. Ganun. Ah. Uh. Is it nung time niyo na 1 hour ba? 1 hour per usually they put like 50, 50 minutes para uh, 10 my minutes time break. allowance oh. to Ang naabutan change, ko din sir yung 20 40 minutes. Oh, oh. Pati si Direk, I guess. Ah, okay. Yeah. Oh. Na every oh. day. Every day. Every day. 40 minutes. Yung tawag doon, Secondary Education Development Program. Ah, yung ah. Secondary Education Development Program. Mm-hmm. Ah, yeah. yun yung curriculum. Oh, yeah. Pero ano, syempre naabutan nyo din ang kuhan. Kasi nga 2017 siya. Nag... Pero you were already in the college nung 2017. Yes, yeah. college. Ah. The, I started already teaching in college 19, uh, 1992. Oh, ay, matagal na. Grumad ako, grumad wait ako ng law. Mm-hmm. O di pinagturo din ako sa college at the oh. same time yung mga political science, mm-hmm. economics, ah, okay. Parang history din lang. Pero manong since na nasa college na kayo ano, hindi eh, nagsuro kayo ng college. What do you think about the K-12 curriculum naman? Syempre, pupunta pa rin sa inyo yung mga graduates mm-hmm. na Oo. No, uh, simultaneously kasi noon, mm-hmm. I was teaching in high school. I was ah, teaching in oh, college. Oh, okay. Kasi, lalo na yung mga uh, practice Swerte teachers, mga uh, yung, yung mga practice teachers, oh, oh. you have to guide them. O, pag, oh, kalimbawa, sinabi mo sa mga practice teachers, this is how to, uh, kalimbawa, uh, deductive method, inductive oh, method, oh. o ganito, pa, paano gawin sa lesson plan. Lesson you know? plan. Mm-hmm. Pero you think K-12 is effective, sir? It, very effective. Oh. <laughs> K- kaya kaya siguro ako huminto noon dahil nung nung nag- actually parang early retirement yes. dapat 2 years pa sana oh, oh. para mag 60 ako pero nung wala nang aakyat sa college sabi ng SLU uh, who would want to have an, an early retirement uh, we will give an improved offer 130% multiplied by in Here. yung kwana uh-huh. yung uh, yung salary mo multiplied by 130% Award. multiplied again by your number of years I so eh nung na, na pinacompute ko oh, umaabot-abot na ng 3 million oh, sige na ay wow baka mamaya Wait. mawala na sa bukas <laughs> kasi kasi wala nang yun ang sinabi ng SLU dahil instead of uh, aalisin kayo na i, uh, parang wala kayong makukuha, uh, ganun parang improve of life. Uh, that's better. Yes. Part, before we proceed to the ating pag-games, ganyan, let's talk about the advocacies naman. Uh, mm, go ahead. I burn. Because <laughs> <laughs> it's more of like um, na- naintindihan ko naman. Um, isa sa advocacy mo actually is for education. Oh. Eh, ano That's ma- one. Ano ba yung five. talagang, sa, syempre for 37 years and since 1992 you have been teaching sa um, uh, college at the same time. Oh. Mm-hmm. So, um, ano yung may isasuggest nyo pa na ma-improve sa ating educational education. system? Oh. Uh, in our educational system, siguro, uh, the and the, the present curriculum K to 12 mm-hmm. is uh, very effective mm-hmm. but then uh, uh, regarding my advocacy mm-hmm. the first and foremost na binibigyan ko na it will be related to education mm-hmm. i would like to introduce policies that would strengthen family ties and bonds oh, yeah. kasi uh, kung ano yung nasimulan mo sa pamilya mm-hmm. Ma- makikita mo sa pa- sa education. sa school o sa education. So, Sir, what uh, specific policies are these kaya for the family? Uh, simple. Uh, siguro magsimula muna tayo sa mga uh, parang mo- motivating uh, activities na there would be family ties and bonds. Halimbawa, ito, simple lang muna. Uh, 
uh, for, for example, when they go out for, uh, let's say, banding, mag, mag, uh, magpupunta sila sa Jollibee, uh -oh. yung pamilya, pagpamilya, bigyan mo na rin ng 20% discount. Ah. Oh, kasi oh, tatlo naman sila, father, mother, son, or daughter, uh, children. They, they would they would be motivated to really go out as a family. As a family. Yes. And they spend quality time yeah. together. Oh. Ah. Simple lang yun. Oh. Marami pa akong nasa isip pero siguro it would materialize when I will be there. <laughs> yes. Okay. Yung mga ganun. Parang so, more or less, parang it's um, encouraging iti family oh. to have this moment together. Yes. Oh, together. Spending time together, allowing them to enjoy. Yeah going to places mm. at oh. the same time economically healthy oh, oh. Exactly. Mm. At saka, this, uh, they they would be able to monitor their children mm. oh. uh, they would be able to talk to them no yet problems yes. or what, oh. whichever in them. Oh. 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 i think that is one good thing oh. then for the yes. family mm. Mm. Okay. oh part gusto man ng family sa, sa education <laughs> naman no. sa education for the city of baguio siguro mm -hmm. uh, it's high time na we will have a, a university managed by the city. Kasi I, 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 I experience, I experience na talagang hirap mag-college nun. Because other cities are, are already having this. Makati, for example, mm -hmm. Quezon, they have their own university. universities. So free for those who are unable to mm -hmm. go to college. But uh, parang uh, socialized yung tuition fee na. Yung may kakayaan, pwede pa rin magbayad. Oh, no. okay. Yes, that's, that's nice. nice. Mm. Having known na, na Baguio is also a, a, oh. one of the north and in center, center of, of education yes. excellence. Yes. Oh, oh. Diba? Correct. Manong, um, I saw din lang, or I read about your advocacy on poverty uh, alleviation. alleviation. And poverty alleviation, yung, yung poverty na ito kasi it has been an issue even before pa. So what would be our specific kwan kaya intervention to get rid of poverty here in our small okay. city? Oh. Although very ideal so, no? Just like uh, uh, my childhood experience mm -hmm. na nagtitinda, mm -hmm. uh, siguro give livelihood, provide livelihood for uh, the poor uh, families. Mm -hmm. uh, kasi ang nangyayari ngayon parang pinagbabawalan yung mga nagtitinda. Perhaps, pwedeng i-allow natin but to some extent na controlled. Hindi yung nawawala lahat. Like for example, in Burnham Park, inalis lahat yung mga vendor, oh. vendors doon. Ano kung kaya uh, lagi, bigyan sila ng uniform na parang tourist mm -hmm. ang tourist oriented activity na ah, okay. naka like you sila. put them in one place yes, with oh. this kind oh. of uniform on ah, strategic yeah. places lang hindi oh. yung totally na alisin mo oh. Oh. Sa bagay. Oh. and of course we also have to identify naman kung ano ang uh, poor family yes, yeah. oh. so identification of them as well oh. okay grabe ah malaking trabaho yan oh. pero <laughs> oh. <laughs> push at kung gusto niyo pang malaman ang mga advocacies exactly. na yan, magtanong lang kayo sa kanilang page. Okay. <laughs> Maestro Mario J. Ay, sarot. <laughs> oh, oh, Maestro sila, Mario De Los Reyes. <laughs> Nung wala kasi ang naisip ko, Mario. Ay, director ba to? <laughs> Mario J. Caparaz. Uh, <laughs> Wait, Ma oh. na. Hindi, pero mayroong De Los Reyes. Oh, Mario J. De Los Reyes, Reyes. yung director. Oo, oh, oh, director uh, yan. At saka, oh. Marami pa actually. But anyway, Maestro naman. Maestro Mario. Um, punta naman tayo sa ano no. Um, five to five talk sort. <laughs> Fast talk. Uh -oh. Ayan. So naka may nahanda kaming mga tanong dito. Yes. Um, no need to explain mga kitip kung ano lang ang pumasok sa utak niya yung sagot din. Ah, yun na yun. Oo. Oh, oh. uh -huh. All right. Ayan, by the way mga parts sa mga nagtatanong or magtatanong kung ano ang page po ni Maestro Mario. Nandiyan lang po sa link. Diyan sa, sa baba, baba at oh. sa description sa taas. Ayan. Kung, meron, kung may nais kayong itanong pa, pwede rin naman ka mag-comment din. Um, Ay, oo naman. At titingnan niya ng mga tumitingin sa page. <laughs> Ganun na nga. Alright, so, Manong, are you ready for, yes, uh, for the fast talk? Okay. So, one word lang, no explanation. Your vision for Baguio. A better Baguio. Uh -huh. 
Okay, voters or votes? What do you mean? Mamimili kayo. Yun. Voters or votes? Voters. Voters. Alright. What kind of leaders do Baguio deserve? Uh, leaders with character. Uh-huh. Okay. So not capitalism or socialism? Mabigat. Capitalism. <laughs> okay. Right. And yeah. then finally, go on. Ikaw naman, yeah. do the owner. <laughs> Manu, how do you define Taraki? Taraki, relating it with my experience in life, mm-hmm. to be a uh, Taraki is one person who can uh, battle life's difficulties and trials. Oh, oh. Perfect. Ano? Perfect. one person who can battle. Why life's difficulties and trials? Bravo. You may not take your final walk. May nanalo na eh. Ganun. Hindi ka na Ayan naman. Anyway. Ayan, ang baka may mga gusto pa kayong i-flag or... Ay, kung nga pala. Parts. Um, let's take also this opportunity to ask an advice naman. Kay of course. Oh. Yes. Kay Manong Mario or Maestro Mario, kung ano naman ang mga isi-share ninyong advice sa mga viewers natin, lalo na sa mga young people nowadays. Okay. To the young people, uh, I don't simply want that you will uh, see me as an example, but uh, on your own uh, face life na makakaya natin ito. Do not take things as uh, simply na kung mahirap ka eh, ito na ang destiny ko. Destiny actually is not a matter of chance. It is a matter of choice. Uh, actually, it is uh, how you deal with the opportunities that come along in our journey of life. Mm. Ay, <laughs> oh my gosh! Ay, ako ko na! <laughs> May, nag-concentrate ako doon sa message ng isang oh, one eh. Manong, thank you very much for the advice. But uh, I'll have here one more last lang. Direct, pwede pa ba? <laughs> one last, sabi kasi, as an educator daw, okay, how will you prove yourself that you can as well be a good public servant? As an educator, Necessarily, uh, in the city council, we need the wisdom of an educator. Uh, a council, as we all know, should be a combination and a mixture of different skills, talents, uh, ideas. Uh, so, as an educator, there are point of views or opinions that would be needed uh, to formulate policies, ordinances for the betterment of uh, the general mm-hmm. public. Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay, All so right. what? Uh, <laughs> 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 okay, anyway, yeah. gusto ko lang din i-reiterate kanina, mm-hmm. lalo na sa mga young people nowadays, destiny is a choice. Right. Mm-hmm. Exactly. It's not a matter of chance. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. It is a choice. Mm-hmm. Alright. So ayun na nga mga parts namin at mga kataragi. Marami na naman tayong natutunan ngayon. Natutunan ngayong <laughs> parang in the binigin yun. <laughs> natutunan ngayong araw na ito coming from the only maestro, maestro Mario de los Reyes. So mm-hmm. diba? Ayan mga parts. And I hope na na-inspire na naman tayo ngayong araw na ito. Kaya mga parts dyan, laban lang. Ayan, mga parts. Alright, anyway, thank you so much. Keep the like, comment, and share kami. Kung may gusto pa po kayong ipa-interview sa amin or kung gusto ninyong makausap namin, ayan, extend na po yan sa comment or mag-direct message na lang po sa aming page, Taraki TV. Ayan. At kung may gusto rin kayong itanong kay Manong Mario, mm-hmm. mag-comment lang din. At saka... Tignan din ang kanilang page. Yes. Ayan. Maestro Mario de los Reyes. Page. Ayan. And 
maraming maraming salamat din po sa ating sponsor ngayong araw na to. EM Avila Law Office, Richard Kilaan Law Office, St. Joseph Driving School, Dirichi Salon, and of course, Kabato Medical Clinic, North Cross Laboratories. Ay, yun naman, alright? So mga parts and mga tarakis namin, keep the likes coming. And this has been Kent. And your parts to go for Tarakito. See you! Bye!